Good morning, everyone. It's your boy, Dr. Corey Kern here again for another Wednesday wake up and workout. So let's get right to it. We already ran a little behind. Okay, we're going to start off. We're going to do a little arms, abs, shoulders, back, hips, all that kind of good stuff today. So we're going to start off a little bike. Just kind of get things warming while I get my katsu on. Let's get some music on. It's Wednesday. It's cold outside, but hopefully it gets warm. Coming up here soon. Let's see here. Uh, this is a pretty good song. It's a good beat. All right, uh, most of the songs I like just because of the beat. I don't really care about the words anymore. That's when you know you're getting old. <sighs> so I'm doing about two minutes here on the bike while I get my uh, my bands on. Feel a little. Uh, <laughs> a little sick this morning. I had a Popeye's chicken sandwich yesterday. Uh, a friend of mine gave it to me, so it was free and I have to pay for it, but I was definitely paying for it later. I like Popeye's, and my weakness is fried chicken. So uh, if you want to find out how to bribe me, just give me some fried chicken. So anyways, yeah, it wasn't the first time I had it, but spicy, spicy chicken sandwich from Popeye's. It went down good, but oh. Man, came back to haunt me. Ugh. So anyways, feel better today. Get things moving a little bit. Try to finish off this week strong. Stopped, uh, look and see. All right, so let's get these bands on first. And we'll get to it. We're gonna hit the arms hard today. It's Wednesday. I like doing arms on Wednesday just because it's the middle of the week. Okay, so turn on your cycle. We're gonna do a little parallel. Get that going. So while riding on the bike, I'm gonna do my three point exercises. What is that? All right. I don't know we're right here on time, so we're just gonna go ahead and start my timer. Maybe go for about another minute. I'm gonna turn this up a little bit harder. And while that's going on, I'm gonna work my forearms a little bit. Don't break the garage door opener. Check. So just working that form a little bit, my weighted stick, kind of going through that range of motion. <sighs> All right. So I remember the first time uh, I met Chuck Wolf. He came in and he said hi, and then he comes right, goes right to the kettlebells and started doing like functional movement patterns. And this is back in like 2007. And I remember I said, what are you doing? He goes, I'm trying to warm up. This is how you warm up. So, blew my mind. Anyways, all right. So, arms starting to warm up a little bit. Stretch those forearm muscles out a little bit. Get them going. Okay, so, let's see here. Let's move this out of the way. So, we gonna use a TRX and some elastic bands. Up first, we're gonna start with a good old squat row. So start with that TRX, about waist level, give or take. And this is just to get those shoulder blades again, real important. So this is part of that basic staple warm up. You're just pulling the shoulder blades back. Your shoulder blades are real important. So you wanna get them in. So TRX squat row, squat. Oh, simple. Squat. Do about 15 or 20, give or take. Somewhere in there. I don't know. Let's stop counting. One more. Uh, get a little calf. So, one thing about Katsu 2 is that you can do some really good jump rubbing. I got the arm bands on now. It's just kind of getting my ankles warmed up. But you put the leg bands on and you go through your jump rope sequence, and you can really fire those legs up. All right, so we want abs. Doing the rollout. Let's see. We are on round four, cycle number one, with the arm bands. So start off with those abs. We're gonna do some rollout, a little anti-extension. I'm gonna do like the swimmer version where you sweep out and come out wide. So I'm gonna work my chest, two, two, go to 10. Three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight, nine. Okay, so squat row, a little pull, a little legs going, and then we're gonna do the T-Rex rollout. Then we're gonna do a bottoms up kettlebell press. Get those shoulders in the game. Three, four, five. Good. Switching sides. Going five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, good. All right. So now we're going to start to integrate some other things in here. Uh, where's my music? Where you go? Sorry, Toby. But we're going to next to that one. Okay. So. Warm your shoulders up, really important. One thing I like to do is just weighted shoulder taps. So you take a bench, kind of line it up. You go on your knees if you want, start in there, get on your hands and knees, and do just kind of like a little push up, a little shoulder tap. As that gets easier, then you go up on your toes. So weight shift around, slide those shoulder blades back, slide it forward, do the old push up plus. Down, up, plus, tap, tap. Just kind of getting those shoulders, that back, that chest kind of fired up. Getting woke up on this cold Wednesday morning. Here we go. All right. We're still doing, uh, still doing arms, right? All right, what we got? One round number seven, second number seven, or second number one, round number seven. We're gonna do a little bit of plyo here. I'm gonna take my, uh, 15 pound med ball. This guy right here. And we're gonna do a couple just little close grip med ball throws. So aiming for about five. Do that this position. Just kind of nice and light. I'll go a few more. Go about 10. Just catch throw. So now our bands are on round eight. It's like one. Get those chest shoulders. Try this warmed up. Okay, feel pretty good, feel pretty good. All right, so let's do this here. Where are we at? We're at the second number eight. So I'm gonna take my arm bands off. We're gonna put on some legs. There's some abs and some arms, shoulders, hips. Gonna work on that rotational power. So, you don't really ever wanna wear the arm bands and the leg bands at the same time. It's too much. Too much, bro. Too much. Okay. Here we go. Here. here we go now. All right. So we got the right leg band. So we're gonna take this sucker. Let's pop that on. Slip that around. All right. Quick change over. Get everything in its place. This is always awkward. But you know what? Sometimes you just gotta swallow it. Put these on at the gym, walk around, people look at you like you're, what the hell's on your legs, man? Say, so, oh, you wish you knew. It's the future of exercise. It's like the pressure cooker of working out. You don't need any more weights. You only need like one or two weights. Get that band under there, get the dude in the right spot. If you get them on, we're gonna crush these arms. Uh, make sure everything's comfy in a good spot. Uh -oh. Dogs are moving. Okay, oh, I see I got the tube kind of wrapped around. And that's all right, we're just gonna pull this around this side. Keep it out of the way. All right, everything's good. Get that in place, cool. Okay, so now we're gonna do pro high. All right, pro high. So, I'm gonna do one round of about 20 little taps on my, oh, this is a good song. It's a good song to bounce to. A little sabotage, a little basic voice. So, again, and then you can even put, I see this med ball behind me. You can do cues like soccer cues, things like that. But just a little hop, 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 a little pops, pops. A little side to side. Get those ankles kind of warmed up. A couple pops. Stretch them out a little bit. There you go. All right, so now we're doing abs, arms, and 
hips and shoulders and stuff. So let's do one set of some DB squats. Just keep those legs nice and loose. Five, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I already feel like I'm going to get a little deeper in that squat. Oh. Ah. All right. So, again, we're doing primarily arms and abs. But everything else is connected to your arms and abs. So you kind of got to do a little bit of everything. So, let's get that out of the way. We're going to start using these rubber bands here. We're just going to do a light chest press. So this is just more so an ab workout. So as you get out away from that anchor point, when you push, you're going to get in that nice base stance, suck your stomach in, and push almost like you're just pushing out as you hollow that stomach. So this is really going to get those abs. And these bands aren't that heavy. But as I push out, I'm really hollowing my stomach. Ab vacuum. <sighs> Almost like I'm hugging the barrel and sucking in. Suck in and hug it. Oh. Good. Okay. Mix that up. A little bit of rowing. This time, we're doing a little heavier. Get those arms ready to rock here. So, TRX, about waist level. We're going to go a little bit further underneath. We're doing about 10 nice pulls. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. All right. Feeling good? Good. So now we're going to do a little combo of a hip bridge thruster with a pullover. Let's get rid of this thing. It's getting hot in here now. I like it. So work out in the morning. It's like a warm up. Right chuck. Okay. Let's grab some of these. Ugh. From Toby Keith to Outcast to BC Boys. You know it. All right, so dumbbell pullers. Great ab exercise. Throw them on the hips. Do some dumbbell thrusters. Yeah, yeah. Hip bridges, whatever you want to call it. Great song, but we don't, I don't know if they take over bombs over Baghdad right now. Here we go. All right, it's easy. Okay, way to pull overs. Where are we at here? We're on round number four. Second number one for my legs, so. Uh, sometimes these songs just kind of make me want to bounce a little bit, I'm like a little squirrel in a china shop. Okay. Uh, so, take those dumbbells, place them onto the table. Now we got the legs banded, so I'm gonna do a little heavier arm spin. Uh, some may see, I don't know. Can y'all see this? You're gonna want to. All right, so, dumbbells there, get to the floor. And again, my cycle's running. And I don't really care about the inflation right now, I'm just rolling. So, get those dumbbells in place. Get your hips off the bench. Take those dumbbells, float them over your head. Oh, keep that stomach tight. Oh, and come back up. We're going to 10, 10 pullovers. Two, these are 30 pound dumbbells, so about 60 pounds. But you can go heavier with this. Oh, keep your stomach tight. Hips up. Oh, great exercise. Feel those abs. Feel those abs. Get stronger. Okay, so from here, the dumbbells, and you plop them down onto your hips, and you bridge, just like that. Go to ten. Up and squeeze. Is it three, four, five? Bounce them. Don't drop them. Six, seven, eight, nine. Dumb them. Roll it. Oh. Okay. 
Uh, okay, where are we at here? So, abs, doing good. How are we doing on time? All right, 580. Okay, so, again, abs, right? So, anti-rotational movements. So, we're gonna do a single arm chest press. So, I'm gonna take this rubber band, and I'm gonna get out with an air point. Again, abs, press. That's easy. Stomach, push, press. Don't let your body rotate. So your body's gonna want to twist. Keep that stomach tight, keep your shoulder tight, and push. Five, six, seven. What are you doing, dog? Eight, nine, dog's doing something. 10, good, switch. Same thing, other side. Ready? Hollow that stomach out, really. Hollow. Don't let your body rotate. Abs are an anti-rotation. Ah, that's that rectus. I don't know, I lost count. That's about 10, right? Okay, good. Okay. How are we doing here? My, uh... Okay. So we're running down here. On cycle number. Round number seven, cycle one. So I'm gonna kill it, turn it off, go from cycle, to training mode. We're gonna take it up to 400. Oh, good timing. Okay, so as this fills up, hey Eddie, as this fills up, then wave, yeah. Okay, so, filling up baby, we're gonna do this. All right, we almost done. We're gonna do one more set of the pullovers. Then we're gonna do my favorite ab exercise. We'll call it TRX uh, side plank rolls. Something like that, I don't know. It's early, okay. So now, you know, I'm just gonna leave this clipped on because we're gonna keep it on the legs. All right, so one more round of weighted pullovers. A little hip thrust. All right, uh, here we go. Uh, going to 10, keep that stomach Muscles tight. <sighs> ah, there's 10, okay. So this time, we're gonna do about 30 of these guys. I'm gonna take that dumbbell, I'm just gonna kind of rest it right here. We're going to 30. One, two, three, four, five, six, oh, seven. Oh, there's my butt. I can feel it now. Eight, nine, 10, 11, squeeze. Tuck it. 12, 13, 14, burning. 17, 18, 19, 20, Okay. Okay, feeling good. All right, where are we? Okay, so we're doing arms, right? Okay, let's do one more round of the rollout too. Just keep things even. We take the take the T-Rex back out. Oh wait, y'all can't see me anymore. All right, this is why I like my gym because we go from one side to the next. Should probably turn that down. I have a feeling someone's gonna come out here and say, "Hey." Wake it up, everybody. <laughs> Where's your music? Turn it off. Sorry. It's a nice day for a white wedding. Here's a good one. Okay. Uh, rollouts. When you're doing these, too, make sure your anchor point is anchored. Mine's not anchored to the ground. So, I like to live on the edge. Don't try that at home. Okay, so roll out this time. Now, like a straight leg deadlift. 
Just gonna roll out. Can y'all see me? Okay, good. All right. Really go out. Okay, so we said arms and abs, right? And we haven't really done a whole lot of arms, but you'll see this really fires up your lats, your triceps, your forearms, your chest, uh, everything else too, right? So nice and smooth. Hinge at the hips. Sweep out and come around wide. Sweep out, come around wide. Sweep out, come around. All right, one set heavy rows, just because I like to keep my back in the game. All right, so now we can go high with that TR. So we can come all the way up to like waist level. Take it, walk under. We're going to do 10 overhand to underhand. So just nice and easy. Pull and squeeze. It really fires up those biceps because we're about to blast them. Four, five, six, seven, ten. All right. Now, I promised y'all the best ab exercise ever. So we're going to do it. Let's go and go for it, okay? So we're going to take this TRX down to about knee level. Let me move this bench. Take that, take that. And you want some kind of cushion. So take a towel, take a pad, take something. Check those elbows. All right, we're doing good on time here. We're gonna wanna see this. This one's really awesome. Okay, so hardest part's getting in. Well, they're doing the exercise hard too. But anyways, take your TRX, cool. So brace yourself, get to the ground, get to the point where you even it out. Take the handles, flip them over. Take that, feet go up in, hook those toes, roll around, and now you're on your stomach. Okay, you don't see me? Good, keep your toes up, ankle source flex, push forearm down, raise those knees, roll the feet, top legs in front, saw and roll. Yeah. Two. Three. Four. Ah, five. Good. Bend your knees. Come to the middle. Forearm down. Roll. Other side. Saw. And roll. One, five. Two. Three. Ah, four. Ah, good. Let's do one more time. Let's do ten. Uh, one as I go out, spray, two, one more good one, yeah, uh, last one, solid, right, in the middle, Knees, cool. Okay. Woo! All right, so now we're gonna finish these arms. So, stop the cycle, pop off the leg bands. That was a good one. Okay, where are we at here? We're almost done? Good, because we're almost done with arms. So stick with me here. This arm blast off is really, Gonna get you going. So, again, take off the leg bands, get those off. We're gonna strap the arm bands on. We're gonna go right to that constant mode, that training. We're gonna do bicep, tricep form. We got enough shoulders, enough back, gets warmed up. Everything should be nice and stable. Let's see here. So, right, throw that on. Simple, easy. Pop it on. That's all you gotta do. Get your gym in the back. Sometimes what I'll do is I'll just kind of put it on there loosely, and then <sighs> catch your breath. All right, we're almost done. I know I said six o'clock. I'm gonna run over a little bit today. Just because. All right, because it's on me. All right, so now here we at. Here we got. Arm band one, arm band two. Yeah, I got like a mohawk thing going on, I don't really care. It's the morning time. 
again. This is my therapy. I just invite you guys to be along with me. All right, so I'm kind of just talking to myself here. We're gonna go to 300. Yeah, that's right. So we're doing constant mode. So 300, fire it off. So now the bicep, we're gonna use the TRX. So this is TRX arm attack with the katsu bands on. So I don't know. Basically, we're gonna attack these arms and they are gonna burn. So for our biceps, we're gonna aim for that 30, 20, 10 scheme and uh, use the TRX to accomplish that. Yeah. yeah, okay. Here we go. So we're gonna do more of like a palms up curl. Going to 30. Two, oh, there. See, again, I told y'all, y'all gotta anchor your stuff. I feel this thing shaking. So that's why we load it up with this. I like to move my stuff around. Okay. All right, start over. Are right, you ready? TRX bicep curls with katsu. Going to 30. One, two, three, four. And the best thing about the TRX is that as it gets harder, you can make it easier by just changing your foot position. You don't have to change anything. Was that nine? 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, they're really starting to burn. 14, 15. I had a sardine the other day for the first time. <laughs> oh, I don't know where I'm at. But I'm also changing from a straight bicep curl to just a curl in a row. Because my arms are burning. I don't know where I'm at. We're going for about four more. One, two, three, four. Oh. Oh. Man, that burns. It's weird because it's like a like the muscles are just tired. It's not so much like a strain. We're gonna cut that off. That's a good thing too, if it ever gets like too much where your arms are tired, you just hit the button and it turns off. Yes, safe. Okay, so as soon as I release, my arms already felt better. So that was about 30 seconds, right? Now if I wanted to get more reps without that feeling, I could always kind of crank down the pressure, but I've been doing this for a while, so I know how my body responds. Start low, work your way up into it. Going to 20. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh man, eight, I don't know if I'm gonna make 20. <laughs> oh, oh, that was 10. Oh, I gotta cut it. Oh, oh. Yeah, so. You know, I could crank that pressure down a little bit, a little bit more out of it. But again, I, uh, I've been doing this for a little while, so I have a different goal, babe. Okay, so we're gonna do my makeshift tricep rope. This is great. Everybody likes to talk about triceps, right? And ropes and pulleys and stuff. And let's see, hopefully, I don't break my camera. Okay. You guys see this sucker right here? So my power rack's awesome but I didn't have a tricep. So, I made one. All you gotta do is get a little pulley here from Home Depot. I got a strap, and then you can buy a piece of cable. It comes in a little kit with little things, and that easy. Get yourself a carabiner and a dumbbell. Next thing you know, you get your own pulley. So, this is what I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna take my 20 pound kettlebell. We're gonna connect it down here on the cable, and we're gonna do some tricep extensions with the katsu. Now I can X or red tricep, which is a good one, but I like my cable, it's fun. All right, I made it, pretty sweet. All right, so, taking that, taking that, y'all see me? Uh, rookie, let me get these angles right. Bear with me. So, I just got a black strap on here. Nothing fancy. All right, so remember, fire up that training mode. Where are we at here? 300, okay. Almost done, are we on time? We're running over a little bit. It's okay, it's worth it. My pythons are burning. All right, so, you can't see me. Let's go backwards. Amateur over here. 
Barracuda. Okay, triceps. Push down, and you pull out too. Right, so as you press down, pull back, you can spread apart. Again, we're going to like 30, there's a like seven, eight, nine. The only thing is my weight starts swinging, so I pause up. Don't shake, no momentum. And then 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, ah, 17, they're burning. 18, 19, 20, Oh, I'm definitely gonna have to do a recovery cycle later. It's good thing about this too is you can uh, you can do a cycle later in the day to kind of help flush your arms out because my arms are burning. Ho! Oh. Okay, killed it because my arms are hurting. So again, listen to your body. If your arms are burning, then let it go. Okay. So already feels better. Firing it back up. We do one more set of triceps. So again, see if it gets 15. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 13, 14, 15. Oh, oh, that hurts. Okay. Okay, we're out of gas. Remember too, while you're doing katsu, make sure you ramp up your protein. This really helps increase protein synthesis. So as you do this, and muscle fatigue, you need to fuel your body. You gotta be hungry. Okay, so we're gonna finish this off. A little bit of forearm work, just because forearms are fun. You gotta keep that strong grip. All right, so again, I had to kill the cycle for the training. Fire it back up. Last thing, I like to do five in each direction on each hand and switch, okay? So start off. Just a little radial honor deviation, right? Two, three, four, five. Good switch. One, two, three, four. And easy to top. Five. Good. Now a little over and under. So over, back. One, two. I like to go elbow bent. Three, and you can switch it up. Four, five. Good. Okay. Good. A little twist, right? So hold it up. Little clocks. One, two, three, four, five. Other way, man, my forms are burning. Three. Ugh, something so simple. All right, five and five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Five. All right, Ugh, they're burning. Last one. I like to call this, uh, I don't know, like tomahawk throws or like, feel like I'm in brave heart and I like a sword. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Basically, I like to imagine if I had to carry a big old sword, I think I could hang on to it. One, that's two, three, four. <sighs> okay, all right, that's good. We went a little over today. I always start a little late. I'm perpetually late. Yeah, you can ask my wife. So, kill the cycle, turn it off. When I say kill it, I just mean turn it off. Don't actually kill it, take off the bands. <sighs> take a deep breath enjoy the day. Thanks for watching guys. If you guys like my exercise, my workouts, check me out. We're going to try to do this every day. So stay tuned. Bear with me while I try to work this out. Have a nice day guys. Thanks. Corey out.